So hey again, this is Greg from Count Gregula's Crib doing a little interviewing with all the hosts here. Right now we got Fritz the Night Owl with us, a legend in horror hosting. How you doing, Fritz? Uh, quite well. This is a very exciting convention, and I'm glad to meet the Count Gregula from Chicago. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm pleased to meet you myself. It's like, you Mutual, know. Mutual admiration society. That's right. That's what counts. You know, counts. Get it? Counts. Count absolutely. <laughs> uh, I can't do it like Gregula does. Well, we're doing, yeah, well, Gregula's a, a class act all by himself. I realize you're an, an imitation clone that he's hired, but yeah. he wanted somebody with a good voice, so he got you. So he got me. That's yeah. right. We got similar voices, though, I can see. You know, we both got that deep uh, baritone type of voice going. The, um, the gods of the genes have been kind. <laughs> yeah, right. Mine are Sicilian, so. Oh, see, I'm Italian, so oh. we're, we're in the same so, area. Yeah, not now, too far. My Sicilian family, at any time of the year or day, there is somebody who's got laryngitis. <laughs> is that true in your family? Yeah, okay. I think it is. It might be coming this weekend night <laughs> for me. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> it's like, well, what do you do when you go to these? It's talk. And, well, this is the very first one for me in about 20 years wow and the ones I went to before were really nice mm. but but they were like a terrific high school player musical yeah. compared to this being a Broadway show oh you yeah, know yeah this is like top of the line for the host yeah. it's everybody from all over the country and th they were supposed to have people from Australia but I guess they didn't make it and I met a lot of really super people and I got a chance to reunite with an old compadre of mine Joe Bob Briggs oh yeah Joe Bob who uh, who nice I was a guest host on his uh, when he had the drive-in movie show on uh, the movie channel how so. cool is that so yeah. is it like reunion well, all over we again. hadn't seen each other for I'd say 20 years we wow. had corresponded you know Christmas cards and a note here there and yon, but we really hadn't seen each other for 20 some years oh my gosh, he so hasn't cool. he hasn't changed a bit either I call him I say hey you got to be the Dorian Gray there's got to be a <laughs> portrait of you somewhere yeah. getting grungier every day yeah look at it. it must be a lot of good uh, I don't know maybe he makes it up or something he puts well, a I've, I've heard that uh, I've heard that Count Gregula when the sun goes down, he turns into a, a really good-looking guy with a good voice. But that's just a rumor. That's I don't know how true rumor, it is. Yeah. Don't believe everything you hear. You know, right. that's, you know, that's, that's, that's those people talking. You know, there you go. they don't know what's going on here. You know, but uh, I've seen that you're back on, right? You, you're doing your show all over again. Right. I used to, I was on on Channel 10 in Columbus from 1974 through 1991 and a half. Wow. And I was on seven nights a week. One night of the week was horror films. Wow. The other six were like the musicals, the westerns, the dramas, the war pictures. <laughs> Our program director was a movie junkie, and he always bought the best packages. Yeah. But the people who remember me most from the double chiller on Fridays must have done something right. I won yeah. five Emmys for wow. my on-air performances. Wow. So Congratulations. Yeah. Five and, and I've been great. in radio since 1959 when it was powered by steam. Oh, so. my God. Yeah, steam, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's way before it is like now, all internet-wise and everything. And so. Both the DJ and the horror host and the movie host, it's one of those things I say, I cannot believe they are paying me to do this. <laughs> See, you got paid. That's the great part. We're still figuring that part out yet. We're not sure how that works.